Don't choke, don't choke, don't choke, don't choke. Please, 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 please. Just die. Just die. Where's the knockout? Where is it? You've got to be kidding me. What's up guys, and welcome back to Cuphead. And to start off today's episode, I found the missing barbershop pole from the barbershop quartet. I spent quite a while looking around for him, I didn't really want to do it on camera. Found him hiding in a bush behind a tent, and now he's back. So I'm kind of hoping that they have some kind of monetary reward for me. Oh boy, you did it! We're a quartet once more! Gee, you must have run yourself ragged tracking him down. We can't thank you enough. Let's celebrate with a song. Ready, boys? Key of B-flat. It's nice to rest your eyes And maybe go outside Grab a book and get some air No, guys, this is... I can't even walk away! I'm waiting for the song to end. Hey! No, I, I don't need to take a break, I just started playing! <laughs> guys, guys, the, 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 the song is great! I just, coins, money! I can't even leave. We have to sit through this. Oh my god, just end it! Are you good? That... That was... That was lovely, uh... Can't get enough of that ditty, eh? Okay, boys, one more time with feel- No, no! No! I had assumed I was doing that for more than a song because I could use a couple more coins. I'm sure there's something of use in Porkrine's Emporium. Actually, we haven't been up here yet. Ooh, another mausoleum. And what do you have to say, Mr. Lightbulb? So you have spoken with Quadratus, the watery being across the aisle. That is something few others can claim. Oh, that's the guy that said that I only had 19 deaths. Sweet, okay. Well, I guess we might as well free that hot cup from Mausoleum 2. Is it racist to call her a cup? Pretty sure she's a chalice. Is there a difference? <laughs> Either way, this is a cool little minigame. I really enjoyed the first Mausoleum, even more so than the running gun levels, because getting the coins and surviving the entire thing is a huge pain in the butt. <laughs> but this is actually looking quite a bit more difficult, because I actually need to chain multiple parries now. Oh, I can only imagine what the later mausoleums must be like. Ooh, 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 Trixie, Trixie, okay. No, she's my chalice, get away. I'm the only one who is going to be dipping his straw in her, I'm not even gonna try. <laughs> whoa, what was it, whoa, who are you? Spooky female ghost, oh, that combo. That was kinda cool. Get out of here, Mr. Ghost. Very Halloween-y in here. Oh, crap. Okay, so they're gonna be over here, and I can... Ah, there we go, okay. I think I've got the hang of this now. Yes, she will be mine. She will give me another ultimate victory. First try, okay. I don't even remember her name. She was just Hot Chalice Lady. I knew if I rooted around here, I could find something special for you, but I didn't know it'd get trapped again. Thanks for saving me a second time. <laughs> Take this magical super art and I'll see if I can find you another. Ooh, okay. I, I kind of like my first ultimate. I think this one is... Invincibility? Invincibility. Cross the astral plane to become invulnerable for a short time. That's what I thought. I remember seeing somebody use it. It wasn't nearly as useful as Energy Beam, even though it sounds great. I try not to watch a lot of Cuphead. I don't want to spoil what's coming up for me, but I have seen other people play the bosses that I've already beaten, and I think one of them used that, so it's good to know. I don't really want that. I want to get my hands on charge. Looks incredibly useful, but I don't think I have the coins. I have three coins. We can get roundabout for four, lobber for four, and charge for four. 
So I need to get one more coin. I was kind of hoping the barbershop poles would help me out there in grateful little signage. But I guess we can go try a run and gun level. It's been a while since I've done one of these. We have Funfair Fever with five coins up for grabs. We're getting to the point now where I'm starting to see stuff that I haven't had spoiled for me in the trailers over the years and stuff like that. Who's that? We're a little Houdini man? <laughs> I know, okay. I almost stepped on you. You're clearly alive. Not only are you vibrating, but you have eyes and what looks like teeth. Why aren't you dying? Weird. Oh, you're nice. And you're following me. I can kind of control you. What? What is this level design? This is really, this is really weird. <laughs> this is very strange, but I think I'm, I think I'm okay. Okay, thank you. I, I, very rare to meet a friendly face in this place. It's usually a bunch of magical puppet Houdinis and terrifying little clown men. Okay, I'm, I, that's not the button I wanted. Okay, I got a coin. We're good, All right? Can you please die? Okay, that's done. And then I can, eh. Can't I just do that over and over again? Oh, it's not getting me, ah, uh, it's not getting me anything. Okay, I guess the infinite ones they don't want you doing. Uh, what on earth? Oh, oh, I don't, I don't know, I don't want that. I don't want that. Don't want the, the balls are gonna hurt. Okay, this is such a madhouse. What is flicking these balls right now? I need to get everything out of my way. Out of the way, out of the way. Oh, it's you. You strange little uh, cannons. I guess circuses have cannons. Sure, why not? Get it, uh, get out of here, stupid Houdini. Okay, I'm, mm, did it, did it. That was all muscle reflex. <laughs> this is, aw, oh, crap. No, no, I don't want to die. I don't want to die, I'm so far. Is that a boss? Oh, uh, oh, uh, no, 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 no. Okay, no, we're good. We're good, get your ducks out of here. You've got your ducks in a row. Don't count your ducks mm, before they hatch. I tried to use a chicken joke and apply it to ducks and it did not work, but we're gonna make it work. I gotta say, I've only seen three quarters of the level, but this one seems way easier than the second run and gun level that I did. The, the one with Woody Woodpecker in the stump? That heavy drove insane. I must've done that one a hundred times, but this one, um, hello, Mr. Terrifying Pretzel Man. I'm just gonna blow you up. Is there some kind of hot dog boss over here? I'm getting uh, condiments shot at me, which I don't really appreciate, but we're okay. You're missing the pretzels, dude. I mean, I don't really want mustard on my pretzel anyway, but I, I, sh I wish I was reading what the sign said. I'm too busy not dying right now. There we go. It is a little hot dog, man. Uh, little is a, a subjective word, but I think this is the boss. Oh my God, that is so much easier. I actually enjoyed this one. <laughs> Very cool. Okay. So did I get all the coins? I feel like I got everything that I saw. Time. What are we looking at? About two minutes. Apparently I'm slow. Uh, didn't get any parries apparently. See, screw it. I got my coins. Let's go check out pork rinds. Roundabout, great coverage with average damage aimed backwards for maximum range. So I'm pretty sure you shoot a hoop and it goes really far behind you. Then we have lobber, medium range and good damage with a slow rate of fire. So you're actually lobbing giant balls, kind of like torpedoes when you're in the plane. Don't look at your watch, I'm going as quick as I can. Arrogant pig. And then we have charge, hold attack to increase damage, no rapid fire, so precision is key. I've been told that this one is really important later on because you only have a few seconds to hit the boss anyway, so you might as well hit them with the biggest damage that you can do at the moment. So let, let's get that. That'll be useful, and then I'll save the rest of my coins. Okay, I'm getting out. Stop looking at your pocket alarm clock. And uh, I don't think I'm gonna put it on right now. I'm pretty happy with the, hmm. Kinda wanna try Chaser. Let's try that, and then I think there's another boss waiting around here somewhere for me. There's another run and gun level. I don't really wanna do two in one video. I feel like the bosses are why everybody watches this. Yeah, here we go. We have Grim Matchstick in Fiery Frolic. Oh, this is the dragon. I'm pretty sure this guy looks incredibly nostalgic. <laughs> that is such a typical 1930s dragon look. 
absolutely love it. And he has eye lasers for some reason. I should be parrying these, getting my damage. There we go. Maybe Chaser was a mistake here, but I feel like charge. Whoa, 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 what is that? Um, okay, he's got fireballs and he's got a tail. Got a wobbly tail, which just goes straight up. Okay, that's fine, that's easy enough. And then we need to watch out for the double fireballs. And, and the tail, and the tail. Oh, oh, I did not see that cloud there. Where's he going? Where did, where did he go? What? No, no, you can't be behind me, that's cheating. Okay, how about this? Take some of that. Is that a miss? That, ow, what are the little fire dudes? Okay, I need, this is why I want to chase her because I knew there was gonna be a point where a boss was, ow, what's with the fire guys? You can't do that. Is there some kind of pattern to them? Uh, oh, you're gonna jump, okay. No, 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 no. I gotta watch the fire guys and the clouds. Thank God I don't have to aim to shoot at him. Careful, 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 careful. Ooh, what is wrong? Why are you giving birth to so many little fire babies, Mrs. Dragon? Oh, okay, good. Next form, moving on, moving on. No, stop being to the left. I want you to the right where I can actually move at the same time. Okay, we're, we're doing all right. Did it just turn into a flamethrower? We're doing all right are some pretty famous last words if I've ever heard them. I really like the tower spinning around in the background as well. They did that with the pyramid level. And it's, it's kind of more realistic, but they used to do that. They would draw the backgrounds a lot more realistic than the characters because the backgrounds didn't really need to be animated per se. They were like hand painted, it's very cool. It's such a pain in the butt though that I need to, I don't need to parry that, that I need to shoot behind me when the clouds are moving in the opposite direction. That's what makes this boss really difficult as well as the clouds being random because a lot of the time there's just no cloud there. So now he's over there. I'm gonna save my ultimate. I'm gonna save it for the final form because that was really difficult. And we can learn a little bit more about the fire. What are you guys doing? You're not gonna jump at me this time? That's uh, whoa, okay. No, yeah, they're coming. I don't see, like some of them are smiling, some of them aren't, but there's no rhyme or reason as to which one is gonna jump until they start to crouch down. So I just need to focus on Cuphead and focus on my clouds and not worry. About, about the stupid dragon. There we go, there we go. Okay, final form. Moving on again. Um, I, I, I'm gonna fall off the cloud though is the issue. I need to use it like right here so that I can land on the cloud. There we go. Okay, please, please don't spit fire. Oh, mm, I didn't mean to jump below. Crap, crap, crap. I need to be above or below the flamethrower. Right? I'm just gonna do this for a minute. Yeah, there we go. That's much better. Where am I? Okay, we're good. I think we're good. These fireballs aren't too difficult to dodge here. I said that right as I dry. Why do I say things? It is amazing how much easier this game is to play when you're not commentating. When you can actually just mellow out and get in the cuphead zone, you feel like you're one with the game and you're completely focused and you don't get hit by the stupid little parading fireballs. Please don't hurt me. I need all of my health to go into this final battle. I, I, they're, they're so random because they're not even getting shot at me. They're just getting shot at random clouds and I have to not be on that specific cloud. I was on the wrong cloud. Oh, okay. I was invincible that time. I was lucky. Okay, we got two hits going into the final boss. That's not too bad. Uh, hit, take that. There you go, that's that's for you. And now I just need to avoid the fireballs and and hopefully avoid all the fire, right? I don't want to get hit by the fire. No, 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 not the fire. Please, please, not the fire. Just just stop, just stop. Okay, you don't need to be like that. We, we can be friends. I'm friendly. I'm just here for your soul. I'm doing so much damage to you right now. Please, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> that's the second time I'm so close. Don't do this to me, fire. Why are you guys so aggressive? We can be friends, I'm friendly, it's like I said. No, I want to go into the final form with my full health, for the love of God, yes, we did it, finally. Okay, I'm getting better, I'm improving. So, hit him with the ultimate. Hit him with it right away. We get that out of the way, and then we need to dodge all the globes. Don't pop them, don't, don't, no, that's, that's hitting them. We wanna dodge them. And then I wanna be up here, 
No, I want to be down here. I want to be constantly aware of where the flamethrower is going. No, come on. I was so close. No. Going in the final form with three points would be great, but uh, I'll, I'll take two. You know what, two is, two is better than none, so you can take uh, some of that. Okay, we just we just need to play de defensive cuphead. Defensive cuphead, very important. We need to watch watch for the flamethrower. There we go, stay up high. It doesn't matter if I hit him during that. I, I'm not looking to do damage, I'm looking to survive. This is a waiting game. That's all cuphead is, it's a waiting game. I gotta say, I really don't like this boss battle. <laughs> Like, aesthetically, he looks awesome. He's a super stereotypical 1930s dragon, and the background is amazing, but there's so much randomness. The cloud's completely random. There's no pattern. You can't rely on a cloud being there when you need it. The fireballs are unpredictable and random. You kind of have to preemptively move, but they have no pattern. So you're kind of just guessing, and I don't want to guess. I want this to be a game of skill. And then, finally, at the end, it's kind of like if there's not a cloud for you to get out of the way of the flamethrower, then you're screwed. You're gonna lose a health there. And then on top of that, the random fireballs that he spits out sometimes burst and sometimes they don't. So there's just very little that you can do here but try over and over again and hope that it just doesn't crawl up your ass. Okay, no, I'm, I'm not enjoying this. We got through with two health again, and I really want to use my ult before he shoots off something that's gonna burst. Okay, he did it anyway. That's not very cool. I need a place to go to get out of the way of the flamethrower, please. Is this high enough? This should be high enough, right? Okay, there we go. He's got another one coming. It's fine, okay, so we dodged that much. Now, please, I want to use a charged shot on him. Yep, there, there we go, okay. Doing, ah, uh, no, 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 no. Don't choke, don't choke, don't choke, don't choke, don't choke. Please, 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 please. Just die, just die. Where's the knockout? Where is it? You've gotta be kidding me. Really quickly while I'm dodging the bullshit fire, how about we put up on screen how many times I've been between 95 and 98% of the way there. It is just mind numbing at this point. I haven't lost a health yet. I haven't taken damage yet. He's gotta be close. Please, please die. Just give me all my health. Yes, finally did it. I'm going into it with full health. I'm not gonna waste my ult right away because I think all that does is make him stronger. Right, it puts him into uh, like a more final form, maybe? I don't know, I just want to use it to dodge something that I can't dodge otherwise. That seems like a much better idea. So where can I go to dodge this fire? Uh, down here? Okay, here we go. So we're just gonna, I uh, that, that would've been a good time to use my ultimate. But I'm just going to play it safe and carefully. Just like this, just like this. I'm gonna hit you sometimes, maybe not other times. Maybe a little bit over here, and uh, okay, you know what? Now will be a good time to ult and pray that you die. Please die, please die, please die, please die, please die. I feel nothing. I'm completely numb right now. That was almost two hours. I don't even want to know how many times I died. Like, yeah, I won. Great. I feel good about that. But it's as if the challenge was to roll a pair of dice a hundred times until you get 12. And when you get 12, you win, but you don't feel good about it. There's gotta be another ridiculous boss around here somewhere. We got a bird. Wally Warbles in aviary action. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna give it a try. Maybe it'll go back to being fun. Good day for us. Or maybe it'll be a giant cuckoo clock. That's a thing. Oh, it's a plane level. Okay, 
I enjoy the playing levels. I think I'm a little bit better at them, to be completely honest. Okay, good to know, good to know. They break and then they come back. That's, that's very important. I wish I was aware of that beforehand. So we're just gonna keep an eye out for that. Uh, okay, hmm. Also turns into fingers. Live and learn. Except in this case, it's really more die and learn. Oh, look at you, giving me the three fingers right off the bat. That's really more of a third date kind of thing, rude. Um, okay, no, we're, we're okay. What's with the nailed birds? Oh, oh, no, I wanted to get the pink one. It was a parry. All right, so how about you suck on that and okay. Now we're getting the rhythm of things. You see, there is a rhythm, there is a rhyme, there is a pattern. I just murdered, ah, oh, I was too busy looking at all the birds I murdered. Uh, was that? Whoa, whoa, what, what, what? There's so much crap on screen right now, oh, come on! What was that? Classic arcade plane shoot 'em up. You just put a whole ton of garbage on screen at once, and oh, I think I just found out how to dodge these. Way easier if you just stick towards the back rather than the front, right? Because they're gonna bounce forward. Okay, now we're talking. How about you have one of these? Boop, right on your stupid bird head. And now he's gonna do the thing where he's real angry and... There is a rhyme, there is a reason, there is a pattern, and you can follow the pattern. Good boss design, okay. Uh, no, no, don't do it again. That's that's a little bit overkill. I don't really appreciate that. I think I'm shooting him all the while, though. Okay, here we go. We got some more nailed birds coming along here. Will you stop with that? Stop acting up, Mr. Bird. It's very rude. There you go. Now you're, you're a cooked chicken, and now I need to kill your offspring? That seems a bit vindictive, don't you think? I knew Cuphead was a bit of a dick in this. Oh, oh, okay. Yep, we can dodge that. We can parry. Uh, you're getting a little bit close, a little bit in my personal space. Okay, no, no, it's fine. Take that. I'm not really hitting him, but I'm not dying. That, ah, uh, that's a, that's all that matters. That's all that matters. I'm gonna get in his personal space. How about, how about that? How about them apples? How about them eggs? Eh, get out of here. Get out of my house. You, you're gonna go right where your parent went. This is a parent, but uh, your dad just kind of choked you out. Ah, <laughs> there we go. What next? We got grandma? Oh, oh, um, do, ow, ow, no. I don't, I don't have a second attack. I thought it, what? Why don't I have a second attack? That doesn't make any sense. That's why I don't have it. I never spoke to you. I could have swore I did in a past episode. Am I losing my mind? I just added an upgrade on your aeroplanes. Now you can wall up your foes with bombs. Just switch your weapon whenever it spikes your fancy. Try it out. Okay, that's just lovely. Kinda needed that a few seconds ago, you stupid canteen. Let's try that again, Junior, except for this time when you shoot at me. Hopefully I will properly parry. There we go, now we're talking. I just need to focus on not taking damage. You're gonna be given damage over time no matter what. I just need to not hit your stupid eggs, aha. Uh -huh. Okay, so now we got the, the wood mom coming back. I'm gonna hit her right in the tits, there we go. And then, oh, oh, what just happened? What's, what's happening? What are the little things that are coming in? Whoa, whoa, doctors, don't spit pills at me. Spit pills at your patient. Oh, a uh, boot, and uh, ah, why am I going after the parries? It's not worth it. Yes! You see what I mean? That feels so much better. Actually challenging and complicated and cool and fun and not doing it 100,000 times and getting bullshitted over and over. <laughs> a dragon has completely, it, it pickled me. I don't know if there are any more bosses around. I think we just finished aisle two. Soul contract of Wally Warbles. Okay, so I kind of split up a family, but I don't really feel all that bad about it. Are there any more bosses around or are we moving on? We finished off everybody down here. We found you. And then, oh, well, actually, you know what? I kind of want to finish off the episode anyway, so how about we go and take a look at how many times I died to that stupid dragon. Through all your battles and all my rhymes, you have failed and perished 57 times. 
<laughs> you know what? I think that's gonna be it for this episode of Cuphead, guys. Even though one boss may have slightly spoiled my experience, I do feel like it's still gonna be a lot of fun moving forward. So if you guys wanna continue to see me play through it, be sure to leave a like on the video, let me know, and uh, I'll, I'll be back to rage a little bit more next time. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.